compasses are aligned to Earth's magnetic field. But watch what happens when we pass an electric current through the wire. The compasses now align to the strong magnetic field surrounding the wire. So a flow of charge produces a magnetic field, as evidenced by these compasses. And watch what happens when we reverse the direction of charge flow. The polarity of the magnetic field also reverses direction. These blue arrows represent the magnetic field surrounding a charge-carrying wire. Watch what happens when we loop the wire. Inside the loop, the magnetic fields become concentrated. So let's wrap wire around an iron nail. Now let's pass a current through the wire. And we've made an electromagnet. Stop the flow of charge, and the electromagnet turns off. But check this out. In making that electromagnet, we've induced the nail itself to become magnetic, as can be seen by its effect on a compass. Earth's magnetic field can likewise induce magnetism in metal objects. How about a can from your pantry? Yep, look how it interacts with the compass. Store the can upside down and see how many days it takes for the can's magnetic poles to reverse. Good energy. Mm -hmm.